Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Now this may be a little bit different for all you guys that are subscribed to me. If you're not subscribed and you're wondering what is all this about, then let me give you a little bit of a backstory. So I'm Jordan, I'm a UK YouTuber. I do tech reviews and I'm also a videographer and a photographer. This video is primarily for Peter McKinnon if he ever manages to stumble across this or you know, somebody sends it to him or whatever, then that's basically my mission. I just want him to see this. And if he takes the time out to watch this video, then I appreciate that. There's no words that can describe how much I'd appreciate you, you know, spending your time watching this. So let's just get into that. I've kind of stylized this a little bit more like Peter. Hopefully uh, you kind of get the effect using an aperture light as well. We'll get on to more of that in the, in the uh, video later on. So there's gonna be a main reason for me making this video that I'll explain to you at the end, but I wanna give you a bit of a background story. So I've been watching Peter for a few years now i did find his eight camera hacks video um which was the first you know one that kind of came to me and then from there on out watched every video that he ever published something about his style that just is just uplifting and you just want to learn so much from it and i've really just incorporated loads and loads of different things that he's taught into my videos um hopefully you, you guys may have noticed the little changes that i've made and little improvements over the, the number of months that I've been watching him. There's one video that really stood out for me amongst all of his videos, and that was the one where he was in his office saying about a quote that was, I believe from his sister, that was, done is better than perfect. For me, my videos, I spent far too long on them, trying to get color correction, you know, t to the exact point and just perfect. Um, and that's one thing that stopped my consistency and upload frequency on my videos just purely because I tried to get everything picture perfect and just obsessing over getting everything just spot on before I would upload a video. That then caused maybe me to do one video a week, maybe one video every two weeks, even longer during some periods. And since I watched that video, that has literally changed how I go about uploading my videos onto YouTube. So there've been a lot of changes that I've put on, so maybe it's different transitions that I've learned from Peter, putting sound effects on those transitions, background music, epidemic sound is a new thing that I'm doing, different parts of rigging, lighting. This is an aperture light I'm using now, like really proud to say that I'm actually working with aperture and also DT microphones, which is another one that I never thought in my wildest streams I'd have an opportunity to work with them but the consistency in uploading has helped me manage that goal. So literally I've got Peter to thank for a lot of what's happened like on my YouTube career. Things such as stopping LED flicker on the background of my lights is another thing that I've learned. With my photography, that's come on leaps and bounds from learning things in Lightroom. All of my edits that I've done for recent events and things have just become so much more detailed and I've just had more kind of creative ideas with them. So the done is better than perfect aspect was something that increased the amount that I could upload because I wasn't getting really kind of finicky with details. And then there was another video he uploaded which was called For All Creators. This was where he was saying about keeping consistency and keeping an upload schedule. And over the last two and a half weeks, I've kept a consistent upload schedule with a time as well that those videos have been uploaded and he's literally been the driving force for this change and i'm already seeing the benefits from that in terms of subscribers and views and since peter released his LUT pack all of my reviews have been using the clean and tidy LUT as well so again more information from peter in my content so let's get on to the main obviously point of this whole video that done is better than perfect quite has really changed how i go about my entire youtube career and uploading and my photography videography everything of that nature has been affected from Peter and that single quote. And I wanna get this tattooed on my wrist up here. So at this moment in time, I'm not really in a position where I can just up and fly to Canada to have you write that on my wrist. So I'd like to ask if you could possibly just write it on a piece of paper or digitally write it with, you know, if you use an iPad or something, and then send that to me and then I'll get that transferred onto my wrist. I think it will just be a whole lot more personal and just more meaningful having your handwriting over just some generic font. So I hope this has given a little bit more insight in why this tattoo is gonna mean so much more to me than um, it may do for most people. The amount of influence that Peter's had in my videos throughout the last few years has been just ridiculous. I don't think there's anything that I do in my reviews now that doesn't have some influence from him. And this tattoo for me is gonna be 
something that I can look at every day to remind me why I do this and to keep consistent and just keep the growth going. So thank you everyone for watching this video. Peter, if you have watched it yourself, I can't thank you enough for, the t for you know taking the time out of your day to watch it. I hope we can do this. Um, I'm super excited with the idea that I could have your handwriting on me and the tattoo, that's r ridiculous. But as for everyone else, thank you for watching this story. I hope you all enjoyed it. I'm sure there's parts that I've left out of this um, and there's a few more bits that I'm gonna remember after I've finished recording this video. But I guess I'm just gonna upload this and done is better than perfect, right? <laughs>